Monday with my friend, Mr. Buddha. He wanted to join because Bolt is a little tired. Balti! <laughs> I'm enjoying my coffee at one of my favorite cafes called Marie at Sea here in North Hollywood. Maybe it's already Studio City, I'm not even sure. Um, I love this place. It makes me feel a little bit like I'm in France, even though I'm not. Maybe just because it's an Eiffel Tower right by the door. I don't know. I had a really cool show yesterday. And the funny thing is, I totally beat myself up because I messed up a few times. <laughs> you know, when you don't even know your own song sometimes, what the fuck? But it happens. And me as a vocal coach, I always tell my students, you know what? If you mess up, so what, right? Just play it off cool. And that's kind of what I did. Um, and I recorded the whole show, so on Patreon I'm going to post those uh, clips. But And I will post it on YouTube eventually as well. But um, that just reminded me, you know, fuck perfection. You just got to do your thing. And I still feel a little bit weird about playing without a band. Although I had my friend Tom with me who played acoustic guitar for me on a couple of songs. And that was amazing. What was even more amazing is that during the acoustic songs actually just one acoustic song it was dead silent which is such a good sign i played losing you it's one of my favorite auto's daughter songs and i was so i didn't notice that at the time but when i listened back to the video i was like oh my god people are actually were quiet that is so awesome so i'm really grateful that my friend tom played with me and i really love playing just with the guitar you know um, not the entire time. I think that would get boring for me, but a few songs just totally stripped down. It's so beautiful. So, um, and my show is always interactive because I really like engaging the crowd. To me, it's not just about performing, singing. For me, it's all about putting on a show, getting dressed up, having a blast, and really making the crowd feel the songs, feel the music, and have a great experience, have fun, you know? So I've sold a few CDs, which I'm so happy about. Um, it was an overall really great experience and a lot of fun. And my message for you guys is that, you know, do what you love. Honestly, this is not really making me much money at the moment, and I haven't really played that many shows. But I'm doing this strictly because I it fills my heart. It makes me feel happy. I really love doing it and I think a lot of us don't do the things we love to do the most very often, including myself. So this was so fun and fuck perfection. If I would strive for perfection, I would totally beat myself up still, you know, about a few mistakes I made. And I would also probably not even play live because I would think, oh, I don't have a band, I didn't play a live instrument. and it's. I struggle with that all the time because I want to play a live instrument but I would have to practice more and it requires more time and I probably will do it. However, what's more important to me is that I'm singing right <laughs> and that I engage my crowd, that the crowd is having a great time because that's what they came there for, right? It's a show and I want to put on a show. So my message for you is fuck perfection, do what you love more and just go for it, you know? If you mess up, so what? Nobody's gonna care at the end of the day. If they had a great time, nobody's gonna care. And by doing more of it, I wanna play more shows because I think playing more shows, I don't think, I know playing more shows is gonna get me better and better and better again. You know, at some point with Otto's daughter, we were like an automatic, and that was not a bad thing, it was a good thing. We were like so good, we had so much confidence. We were like, we're gonna kick ass like every night. Have an amazing week, guys. I wish you a fantastic August coming up and do what you love more. I, I, I can't stress that enough because I think a lot of us don't. And life's too short not to. I had so much fun. I feel like a little kid when I'm on stage. It's not about showcasing. It's not about you know trying to get a record deal. It's about having a blast, expressing myself and connecting with people and hopefully make them feel something and encourage and inspire them to do more of what they love. That's my Monday message for you. From the Buddha, Mr. B, Balti gonna say hi bye <laughs> and myself have an amazing weekend I'll talk to you soon bye guys <laughs>